definition of insanity is. Hello there, it is I, the Geordie Nerd, and I am back again with another Archer episode. You probably think to yourself, whoa, it's Saturday, what's he doing with an Archer video? Well, you've said this is the funniest episode of Archer, so you've talked a big game, haven't you? So now I, I have to find out. So if it's not as funny as the last one, I blame you. Specifically you. <laughs> Of course, if you want to see the unedited reaction to this, and you also get it early, uh, the link for the Patreon is down below. Also, it's the link for my Facebook and Twitter. Let's just get into this now and have some fun. Chemotherapy, it's kind of a breeze. Yeah, that's my point. <laughs> Two weeks of chemo with no hair loss, and you're not experiencing any nausea? No, gracias a Dubi Medicina, which I gotta tell you, huge fan. Oh, yeah? Yeah, and I advocate its use. As a potential role model, I advocate it. To combat chemotherapy-related nausea, or for cannabidiol's clinically proven ability to inhibit cancer cell growth. It does that? <laughs> Oh, God. He's, he's on the devil's lettuce now. Oh, I can't watch this show anymore. I do not endorse the use of drugs. <laughs> I got a guy. Me too, Krieger. He's called a pharmacist. Yeah. And is he the same pharmacist who gave you all these chemo drugs? Well, he damn sure didn't give it to me. I mean, you would not believe how much cancer medicine costs. Those pills are like 80 bucks each, and the IV stuff is literally two grand a bag. So why the hell are you poking a hole in my bag, Krieger? Because I want to run a <laughs> wow. few tests. And so... Like, the reagent seriously. Blue, but that, what does that mean? Is that... That is, that is messed up, okay? Like, the NHS in the UK, we get all our treatment for free. Two grand... So if you get the cancer, something that you cannot help, you have to pay for it. That is messed up, man. Not a trace. What? Wait, so I've been treating my breast cancer with sugar pills? Yeah, you didn't think it was weird <laughs> your chemo drugs were chewable? No! Like, little kids get cancer. <laughs> oh, they do. Well, what about the intravenous... No! Oh, you've just made us laugh at that. Oh, that is fucked up. You're going to, you're going to hell, you, Paul. Oh, nope. Nope. Move on. What? Krieger, what the hell is it? Well, this is just an educated guess, but, um... Zima? What? <laughs> what, the, what is Zima? <laughs> is that a drink? So why is he not being treated for cancer? Oh, crap. All this time, it's been... Growing, I guess. Oh, Sterling. Plus, God knows how many other cancer patients have been taking that stuff. <gasps> like Ruth. Here you go, folks. A week's supply of breast cancer chemotherapy drugs and, uh, of course, your medical marijuana. Oh, you poor oh, thing. Oh, that's Ruth. Does someone you love have breast cancer? <laughs> yeah, me. I'm, uh, <laughs> name's Archer. Ruth. And don't you worry, dear. We can beat cancer with this medicine. So the, the pharmacist's been giving them fake cancer drugs. The absolute scumbag. Come on, it's time to get in the danger zone. <laughs> oh, cool. <laughs> oh, oh, God. I think he gets it. Just fill <laughs> he did all that in front of him. Oh, oh, my ribs. Oh, God, only dogs heard us laughing. Oh, that was, that was funny, man. He, he locked and loaded in front of the chemist. Oh, that's, I've actually got a hip, I've got a brain injury. My head hurts. Oh. Wow, what a pussy. I could barely even keep up. He was spilling the beans so fast. Well, you threatened to shove a knife up his dick hole. Which again? <laughs> well, excuse me, Lana. It's a rampage. Still, though, you really want to take uh, on the Irish mob? No, I don't. But they're the ones switching out life-saving cancer drugs with candy and Zima. And why couldn't it be the Brazilian mob? Estou aprendendo português, Lana. Uh, nice. Well, so I can only assume a Brazilian mob would be a jillion times sexier. So he speaks Portuguese now, like, oh, as he always, and he just hasn't until this, this episode. Name the douchebag who's in charge. Vincent Van Gogh yourself. Hmm. Oh. Vincent Van Gogh myself. Survey says. Oh, oh, God. God. What, what the hell? hell? What, Lana? I said it was a rampage. Still, though. Oh, you're so oh. Save it for the f oh, you son of a horror. Yeah. That was great. 
So I'm assuming he's going to keep saying Rampage a lot. Because a lot of people said that in the comment section. And now I know why. <laughs> it's fucking gold. Need an answer. Hmm. Cock flavored spit. Well, you never know what's going to be on the board. <laughs> Let me see. Cock flavored spit. <laughs> Guys, that's two strikes. One more, and the innocent Honduran janitors get a chance to steal the bank. <laughs> I'm just assuming you guys don't know what I'm thinking. I've just realized he's playing Family Fortunes. <laughs> Pause yourself poorly making a video, man. You fucking idiot. <laughs> Alright. This is the funniest episode ever. Whew. Oh. Whew. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> Family fucking full. Compose thyself, Paul. Well, let's go. You say one word and I'll cut your yellow heart out. Uh -uh. <laughs> Uh, Mikey, you gotta listen. I have breast cancer. You really think that's a good idea? Hmm, let me see. To take my prescribed chemotherapy for my said aforementioned cancer? Yes, idiot, I do. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry I called you an idiot, Mom. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, my God, as if he started taking it in the middle of a rampage. Throw it out the window? Obviously. Yes. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm gonna be sick again. Not in here, you're not. Well, then pull over, Lana. No, we're late. Oh, you oh, might have missed your shot oh. at Delaney as it is. Well, then now this is happening. What? Oh. Lana, did you see my scarf? Yeah. He's he's gonna hotbox our car, isn't he? <laughs> Look at me, like I'm down with the kids talking about drugs. <laughs> You're sweet enough to come see a sick old lady in the hospital. Nice. What? I didn't come by to see you. I'm trying to bang a candy striper. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, it's not good, huh? No, dear. Archer. <laughs> Archer! What? We're here. Oh, right. You good? <sighs> Rampage! <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh, that, that poor old lady's gonna die. That's horrible, man. This show. Leave me alone. I am not a Nazi. Yeah? Well, what about your father? No, he was a scientist. Pretty sure the Nazis had scientists. No, they didn't. That's why we... They lost the war. Lack of science. Well, we'll just see what Ms. Archer has to say about this Nazi beeswax. Fine. Or, you know... Not fine. <laughs> because between the cancer and the chemo and the just shit tons of weed. Ooh. Yeah, let's smoke some more weed. That's that's always a good idea. Thanks, Woodsy. The drug owl. Now shut up oh. and kick in the door for me and do it badass like I would if I still had toenails. Jake, Joey, you call this a hand? More like a foot. A great big Franny Delaney! Did he just crack on my scarf? I think he did. Wow! One, he just blew that guy's head off, which was fucking awesome. And two, he just shot right next to Lorna's ear. <laughs> oh my good god. This episode is the best. One more crack about monster hands and I promise you I will shoot your fat Irish faces off. I'm sorry, was that racist? I'm not mad at you. I'm sorry. I'm mad at Archer. And thanks to him, I've got two perforated eardrums and I guess I've just been... <gasps> Getting hot boxed all day in my car, shit, which I'm trying to sell, but fat chance now. I bet it smells like weed and rampage. Damn it, that is classic <laughs> him. Oh, I knew it. See, I know, I know. I'm just, I'm just fucking cool, man. I just, I know all about the drugs. Just one of the, one of the gang smoking the doobs, doobies. <laughs> You're an ISIS agent. You got a sense of honor. Fair play. <laughs> what? You obviously haven't seen my movie, uh, Terms of Enrampagement. <laughs> Hang on, that was like. Oh, you killed my men, sure. But they were armed. I'm just a sick old man in a wheelchair. You can't do it, boy. I know you. You don't know me. Terms of Enrampagement. That is 
That is a better movie than Terms of Endearment. I think, I've never seen it. Delaney. Yes? Did you see Regis this morning? Yeah. Why? Nice. Actually got goosebumps there. Fuck me. I hope he has killed him, because he d deprived Ruth of her cancer treatment drugs. Fuck me. Why well, I'm getting emotional. I'm not going to cry. My friend, it was two weeks in Phuket. Anything goes over there. Thing. <clears throat> Wildly inappropriate. Seriously, Pam. Okay, Clone Wars. I love that he's ki he killed him. That for, for Ruth. That was definitely for Ruth, and that is brilliant. That is fantastic. I'll probably never get any sort of cancer again, ever. So shut up and watch my movie. For which I really need a better title. Oh, how about Citizen Dickbag? Snark victory. Wait, I got it. Casa Blumpkin. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, okay, yeah, so, uh, uh, this was definitely hilarious. This was fucking gold. This was, this was genius. I loved every second of it. It was fantastic. It's funnier than the last episode. The last episode is hilarious, but this should have been like two parts, like a two parter kind of thing. And I, I don't think it was anyway, or it, or it could have been like a movie <laughs> inside a movie. But yeah, honestly, this was great. It was fantastic. I mean, obviously while, while laughing at cancer and cancer is fucking evil. Like I said, I've lost family members to cancer. Um, no doubt people watching this w w would have as well. And it is a horrible, evil thing. And it did, I did get a little bit emotional. I didn't cry, thankfully. Um, but I felt that there, you know? I mean, especially when he asked if um, the, the, the bad guy, whose name I forget, watches Regis um, in, every morning. And I just, I knew straight away he was, was going to, he was going to shoot him. Um, rightly so as well. Because he deprived Ruth of her cancer medicine. And that's, I mean, that's just evil. <laughs> but of course, these are fictional characters. But in real life, you know, you do get... Sadly, people who do pass away. But anyway, um, yeah, this was funnier than the, the episode before it. Definitely. Um, the This and that, I would say, are ties with my favourite episodes, though. Because they were brilliant. Um, the, the both really were. Uh, so yeah, I'm I'm just going to leave it there. Uh, as, as, as ever, it's a fantastic show with... what amazing writers great cast and the music the intro is phenomenal um and i'm just wasting time now so yeah of course um there's an extra episode of archer this week and there's still going to be one on monday so look out for that too uh thank you very much for watching i really do appreciate it like as always if you're new subscribe share it around if you know somebody who likes archer and you think they'd enjoy these reactions please do share it around i'm trying to get to 5,000 subs i'm 50 away as of today so hopefully by the time you have seen this, I'm on 5k, but uh, yeah, I've been the Drawing Nerd. Thank you for watching. I'll see you all again soon for more Archer reaction videos.